the lane safe on Invoker. It's not gonna be good for them. There's still a few that loves passive starts. In fact, he's already got four napalm stacks over on uh -oh. Fenrir. He's not Rizzy. Really gonna try to have a crack this one with five napalm stacks. He might give it a shot, but with the Barra Spike, six napalm stacks. He needs one more attack to kill off Fenrir. First blood, where is it? A two. He gets first blood. Really worth the trade for him. He gets in there, he gets the experience, and he gets the bonus. But you don't have level sixes over on the two supports of C9. You don't have Misty Play, you don't have wards. They can have a kill here on Fenrir. Play break, play break. He just used Lasso. That's one way to ensure the kill. A little bit of overkill and Fenrir popped down while Super getting Searing chained up. Prophet Oddy will bounce through as well. And now he, he's in a real trouble. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Okay, yeah, they find him. They find him. But they reveal the blink dagger to catch Owie in the tree line. This is their only downside. The start is not very good. No. Top tier 2 tower is it's gonna be forfeit if we're not gonna try and fight this. Like, it's just that simple. Pana is hanging in the trees where it's a little bit safe. The weave starts up. That's gonna pop up some of it. Did they catch down super now to blink last two? She's crying inside the back into the mystic flare! They nuke him down so quickly! The Firefly is also taking care of most of the creep wave. Fenrir is not too healthy. He couldn't get in range to get the Shadow Grave off Here either. The and now the Searing Chase on Fenrir. Is he going to have to use the Shadow Grave himself? on himself? He doesn't want to have to do this. The orbs are coming out. More supports there. FY, every center end. How he evaporates. And just the Sandstorm. And Nara TK as well as Super. They go on the charge. Highlight die. That hit is almost 300 a pop. They move through. The Couriers are going down as well. MV4 star back inside. The fact that you always have to play around with Batrider. Look over Batrider, he's got a massive man. He can pull an enemy all the way back to his T4. Oh, Initiation's gonna go on against Sing Sing. They're gonna doom him up. The Mystic player's gonna come through Sing Sing though. He's just running straight back to the throne. Highlight die. He's gonna be one of the drums. Sing Sing's still alive. Envy, he silenced up. He needs to get out of there. Envy's gonna be dead. He does not have buyback at this point. No, yes, he does. Benroy gets dropped all the way back to the fountain. He's straight up dead. Double buyback from Cloud9, and they will hold. They need to get a little bit more than this, though. They can't force Sand King. Again. It's a double series. Chains of Sand King. He went on Envy, who dropped the meteorite over on Super. The Sky Wrath Mage. It's a big hole for the Tornado picking up FYO. But there's your Mad Serpent Wards. RTK can be focused with the off damage. The BKB and protection for now for Super. Being dragged back into the oh. line. He still brings down Envy. He was able to get one last quill off. And Envy will have to take the fall. No, he's coming back. He's coming back. They're not going to play chicken on this one with VG Gaming. Lasso! They got Super! The Mass Serpent Wars going to make a nice bump here. Skyrath Mage on and Super! He's not dead yet. The main charge will go off. Fenrir is still in here. There's four heroes. They're almost at the well of Cloud9. They kill off Sing Sing. He flies back around Mass Serpent Wars. Here's the Siri Chains! Super! The Shadow Grave must protect him here, but he can't look at the walls. So he has to come oh. up. He gets off Prone 7. F. He's at from FY. How are as well as Sing Sing? Virus strikes up, but FY is in way, way too deep. Well, tell him he drops them all, but Fenrir. He'll also drop here. Three heroes on the side. The pop, pop lane. The range directs actually down a half life. The catapult's doing the work up there. Flying vision, all of these trees. In fact, he's doing here that right now. The here trees are not going to get here in time. It's going to be. Late. Can't get away with him. They're away with Roshan. FY with the label, but he doesn't have everything to get. But out they come, Sing Sing. He's got to get back over with Master Force to Envy. He's still stuck inside. And the Bad Rider actually fly flying and dragging FY. Super, however, on the front lines. They've lost both their supports here, C9. But the Master Force are still helping them out from inside the pit. Envy will go right. Bad Rider actually some... blinks left. They're trying to get themselves out of here. But now you're going to have Eternal Envy getting doomed up. And he will go down on this bottom lane. He actually dropped the Midas, yes. I believe, to pick up the cheese at this point. And Bone 7, he actually grabs the Midas and TP's out inside the pit. The Blink Dagger, there's your last they seal him up. The Star Wars Major, they're dragging back so far. And oh, Warcraft! go down, but the Mathon is actually a heal. The heal as well, Shadow Grave will keep him up in the epicenter on Bone 7 and Owie. They are going to go down, Owie. He actually ended up having what, the cheese in that one? Slide of Fish from Sing Sing. He's trying to turn this fight around. They still got the Mass Serpent Wars, but most of them actually have gone down. While well, RTK and Super pick up Eternal Envy. Fenrir just walked himself away. It's a three for one trade. FY also on a hundred. Oh. Oh. 
that heel on the tree, an orchid on Sing Sing. Sing. He's in so much trouble right now. And so is all of Cloud9. VG Gaming, they're coming high ground. Mass buybacks, both Ember as well as Invoker. But only VG Gaming can stop it. We don't have a for 70 seconds. They know they have an opening. That's in Blast, pushing Super back. Envy, he's got to keep the battle going. With the call snap, Faris strike. Find Envy, ROTK, Hawk stopping himself in up the Blink Dagger. Four stopping Envy up. It's not far enough, though. It's a death buyback, and they go through more. I don't know if the difficult fight here in C9. The Skyrim may dominate, trying to chip away here at VG Gaming, but they turn around, Blink! A triple Faris strike from FY! He's got them all, and maybe even Bone 7. He's got Tyler dragging him back inside. It's a small collateral damage right now for VG Gaming. They want the melee ranks, they take the range, they take both. The top lane is also pushing in. VG Gaming do not have to back up right now. They definitely could face tank it. The next person that's respawning is 26 oh. seconds. Another throw yeah. strike. Boom, seven's dead. The entire okay. team of Cloud9 okay. is dead. GG. FY. FY just opened up a huge hole in C9, and the rest of BG Gaming just pushed themselves straight through it. That was a brilliant, brilliant tanking, man. I think I really disagree with Bone Seven's item choice. A Black King Bar would have made him survive that epicenter. He would have done so much more being alive in that team fight. It was multiple buyback being shredded through against Cloud Nine. VG Gaming, they were so behind thanks to the rat Dota of Cloud Nine. But a simple fight from Cloud Nine making a mistake. The last two pulls.